My name is DJ Javier. I am an artist and graphic designer from Santa Barbara, California. My parents came from the Philippines to the U.S. in the early 80s, and I think having their son pursue a creative career was not in, like, the playbook whatsoever. For good reason of my parents gave up everything to come to the United States. More and more my parents have just been so stoked on me being able to do this kind of stuff and it's been super cool to like just kind of show them that journey. Most of the music and you know that I ever listened to growing up was rap music and so that played like a big influence with like a lot of my creativity and then like with my art like tagging around the neighborhood and being into different like street artists and graffiti artists and skateboarding, how it kind of like opened me up to like a lot of people that I look up to. Um, you know, I was just like the worst skateboarder in the whole neighborhood, but I was obsessed with the graphics on the board and like t-shirts and that passion for art and creativity, that spark that was there, then just kind of grew like a wildfire into like the rest of my career. All those things kind of culminated into like where I am now creatively and um, I mean, I didn't learn how to surf until I was 18 and I didn't learn how to swim until I was 17. And so, yeah, like I just didn't really look at surfing as something that was for me. And I wasn't, in, it wasn't until I like actually got on a board and like was pushed into a wave at like 18 where I'm like, wait, this is, this is honestly like one of the best things that I've ever experienced. And yeah, that has like really merged itself into my work to the point where like it's invaded like how I creatively look at things and like the work that I do and the art that I create and obviously like with the work I did for the Surfers Journal, it's in my own world of how I see surfing. With everything I do, whether it's like graphic design or like painting or illustration work, um, apparel work, a lot of it just starts as like a small sketch. And so I'll just have like a bunch of sheets of computer paper and I'll literally just like Instead of like taking notes and writing my ideas down, I just draw like little doodles essentially. This whole, you know, collection with Surfer's Journal was like me showing up like a bunch of little doodles until we kind of landed on one. For me at the end of the day, I feel like it really boils down to growing up, I didn't really like see myself surfing or like partaking in that activity. It's just like this constant drive to like inspire the younger version of me who might not see themselves as like a surfer or as like a, or as an artist and to kind of show them like hey you can carve your own path you can do your own thing you can stay true to who you are um, and do really fun and cool stuff at the same time and so um, being like a drop in the bucket that's continuing that conversation and like creating more of like like an opportunity path for just the young version of me.